Let's talk about rond de jambe à terre. Rond de jambe is a circular motion of the leg, and à terre means that it stays on the floor. There are two ways to do this. One is en dehors, which means outside, and the other is en dedans, which means inside, and those refer to the direction that the leg takes. So let's start in first position. Now, the tendu goes to the front. On the en dehors, we're going from the front side back, right? So that it's an outside rond de jambe. Tendu to the front, just as we would with any other tendu, right? Toes stay on the floor. They carry to the side, to the a la seconde position, and then all the way to the back to the arabesque, and then pull back in to the first position. That's your tendu, that's your rond de jambe en dehors. Now, the reverse, going from the back side front, is en dedans. So we go to the back, just as we move with the tendu, carry it to the side, turning the heel forward as we get to the al second, and then front, again, heel forward and pull back and settle in first position. Now, as we do this, the rond de jambe faster, there's a tendency that people whip the leg around, either crossing way in front and then going all the way to the back, changing the alignment of the hips, or the reverse, going all the way back and round around, right? So you're not doing anything different in the, in the hip alignment. It just goes directly front to the second, to the arabesque, and close. You also want to make sure that when you're coming from the back, that the heel, that you don't end up uh, winging your foot out, beveling your foot out as you come from the, from the back. Um, because sometimes what happens is, as we think so much of wanting to pull into the first position, using, again, always using that inner thigh, that the, the toes get left behind. So you want to bring it all in together as you would with a, uh, with a tongue coming back from the, from the arabesque. And going, again, from the reverse, you want to make sure you get all the way to the back, all the way to the side, and all the way to the front. So don't miss any of those positions, right? Front all the way back and close and reverse on the down and pull it back into the first position. And that's how we do run the jump.